Happy fall, everybody. We just passed the autumn equinox and looking forward to some great market action to pull in pips for those cold weather coffees. This week, we have an indicator from one of our celebrity warriors. We found this indicator after a comprehensive search over a few sources since we were looking for something a little different this week. We weren't disappointed. Furthermore, we think we fixed our popping peas and teas with some additional recording equipment, so sit back, grab a snack, and enjoy the show. We had a bit of a snafu this week when recording the market. Right at the start, the computer recording the market decided to update a program and insisted on telling us all about it with a big white box in the middle of the screen. Thankfully, we saw it relatively early on, so we didn't lose the entire session. That being said, we were able to resume our data gathering efforts fairly close to the open of the market. Pretty interesting video, as you'll soon see. Okay, so this week's indicator is a below chart, two lines cross, confirmation indicator. We were somewhat surprised to find this indicator written by John Ellers because of its current development date. Posted in the May 2020 Stocks and Commodities magazine, the Correlation Trend Indicator magazine article includes the easy language code for those of you who like to partake of that venture, but for the rest of us, the indicator thankfully was born into the MT4 world in the same year. While the word correlation appears in the title of this indicator, some of you may have thought it had something to do with the correlation of currencies. This is when you would buy particular currency pairs and sell other currency pairs in what is called a basket for an overall gain. While that is a thing, it has nothing to do with what we're doing today. This two lines cross indicator is built on the correlation or relationship between the trend and the cyclic component of the market. In the article, correlation is described through the lens of a perfect trend by comparing price if plotted as a straight line. Positive price is a positive slope with a plus one correlation. If price has a negative slope, the correlation is negative one. And if price is sideways, then there is no correlation. Thank you again for your emails. VP and I really appreciate your efforts and collaborative spirit. We did have one email come in that we wanted to mention. That person asked about testing results of an indicator we blogged about but wasn't profiled on VP's channel. A fair question. The answer is that we will at some point go back through the blogs, which were not on the indicator profile channel, and include the testing data. In the meantime, please continue sending your magnanimous musings to stonehillindicator at gmail.com, and as always, we tip our collective hats to you. Now that we've dispensed with all the preliminary items, let's get to the good stuff. We were able to start our recording soon after the market opened, which gives us a little insight to how the indicator reacts to varying market volume. Naturally, we like this because we never know what to expect. Ready? Steady? Get your groove on. We'll jump right in on this first long signal. Let's see how it goes. Well, that was a nice run right out of the gate. If that was on the daily time frame, you'd be grabbing your towel and heading for the beach. Isn't that interesting? Price had a couple of high volatility movements, then flattened out, but look at what the indicator did. There was no guessing what the signal was. Huge amplitude here. Easy on the eyes. What's next? Again, we've got a really obvious signal and indicator reactivity to relatively minimal price movement, but the overall trend was indeed to the upside, so it's not wrong. We like that. All right, short signal coming up. There was a little bit of a head fake there. Price still continued up after the short signal, but then retraced down into a profitable trade. This is where having your algorithm in place is paramount and not bouncing out of a trade based on gut feelings. You would have been a sad sack if you missed those easy pips. Now, let's go long. Price looked like it had one too many espressos there. An overall upward trend, but it would have been a bit of a bouncy ride to the next signal. Shall we see where this next short signal takes us? Let's go. An obvious loser there. Book it up in your journal, sharpen your pencil, and get cracking on this next short signal. Ouch! Your algo or stop loss would have taken you out before the full upward movement, which is why we follow our rules. Write that in your journal and let's move on. Boy, we've got a streak going on. A first in this series, 
don't hate the indicator. Remember, this is a long game venture and you're not using this one indicator to trade. Keep those emotions out of your trading room. Woo, finally got a winner there. Okay then, we'll run it out for a little bit more so you can watch the pretty lines do their thing. We absolutely loved how articulated the signals were. The pronounced amplitude of the blue and red lines were very helpful when identifying our entries and exits. One of the value added bonuses of this indicator is the ability to choose which data set to use for the internal calculations. Unlike many indicators, which only have between 3 and 7, this one has 33 available sets as noted here. We tested through all of them and were able to get some excellent results through all four markets and both testing horizons. Don't let that losing streak put you off. Remember, this was the one minute time frame over a couple of market segments. It's just an example. Check out the results in the blog after the video to see how it did. Go grab this indicator from the library on the Stonehill Forex website for free and give it a go. We like this one and hopefully you will too. No sir, you won't get any financial advice from us. It's not an endeavor we chose to undertake. Besides, do you really want to take advice from someone who makes their living taking your money, no matter if you win or lose? Yeah, us neither. Your own financial independence is one of the best feelings in the world. Making those decisions to find your independence can be quicker by heading over to the Stonehill Forex website. Over there, you can explore all of the free resources, check out a killer deal with Blueberry Markets for non-US traders by clicking on the landing page link to get you started. Of course, you'll want to check out the No-Nonsense Forex course with a personal message from VP to all you traders. This course is the only one endorsed and approved by VP. It took over a year and a half to put it together and you can even read about each course module on the website before purchasing. Have questions? No problem. Just email us. We're happy to provide you with answers. Don't forget to sign up for the periodic digest we put out each month. We've got the next one coming out soon. You'll want to see what we're up to. In fact, you can sign up right on the website from any of the blog pages or just click on the email list tab at the top of the page on our website. If you want to get last month's digest, email dan at stonehillforex.com with the title, Latest Digest Please, in the subject line. You'll have it within 24 hours. We're also on Facebook, answering all kinds of Forex questions on Quora, and of course generating more helpful YouTube videos on our channel. Go to the website. We think you'll find something helpful there. Our only goal is to make you a better trader.